in this video. I've got a really cool image map plugin for WordPress that I want to share with you guys. What on earth is an image map plugin I hear you cry? Well, that's a good question. <laughs> Basically, it's a plugin for WordPress that uh, enables you to make your images interactive. What I mean by that is you can draw off certain areas of that image. When people click on those areas, you can give them some extra information, you can show them another image, or you can send them to another site or another page via a link. So you might want to use it for a floor plan, for example, that you have on your website, and you can allow people to click on the different rooms and get more information and see more pictures. Or maybe you'd like to add an interactive map to your WordPress website so people can click on different areas of the map and again, look at pictures or get more information or go off to another page on your website. I've used the plugin to create an interactive image for my affiliate marketing website, wheelalong.co.uk. And basically it's a fantastic way of showcasing one of my electric wheelbarrows. So I think that's enough intro. Let me take you through what this plugin is and how it works. Let's go. Hello, it's Alex here. Hope you're all keeping well and staying safe. So the plugin I'm talking about is called WP Draw Attention. I'll put a link up in a card now. You'll also find a link in the description. It is an affiliate link, so thank you very much if you use it and if you purchase the plugin, uh, which by the way costs $74. You can use it on one site for that and you can have unlimited images. If you wanna just try it out, there is a free version which you can find via the plugin section of your website. Just click add new and do a search for it. But let me show you how it works. So I installed it onto wheelalong.co.uk, which is my wheelbarrow and trolley affiliate site. I'm sure you're aware of that if you've watched any of my other videos. And basically what I was looking to do is to create an interactive image around one of the powered wheelbarrows. And the reason for this is that I actually sold one of these via an affiliate link just the other week. Um, it's the Makita powered wheelbarrow. It runs on batteries. It's a pretty impressive bit of kit. But the problem with it is when you order it off Amazon, it doesn't really come with everything you need. It doesn't come with the actual barrow bit, you know, the bit that you put stuff in, and it doesn't come with batteries. So this plugin is really good at overcoming that because I've been able to create an image that I've inserted into my content of the wheelbarrow with the accessories attached and basically enable people to click on the image and kind of hover over it and see what the different elements are, and then when they click, they get redirected off to Amazon via one of my affiliate links. So as you can see, that's pretty cool, isn't it? Uh, and it's great for affiliate marketeers who want to showcase you know, a load of products that are in one image. Maybe you've got a picture of a car and you want to show you know, all the different elements. Maybe you've got a picture of a room and you want to show the different bits of furniture. You know, it's great for that if you've got those kind of big images with lots of different things on that you want to you know, link off to or share more information on. So let me show you how easy it was to create that image for my blog content. Basically, you need to get an image, of course you do. You need to install the plugin, which is pretty straightforward. You just you know, install it and then you get an extra area within your WordPress dashboard where you can create your interactive images. Within there, you'll see there's an add new and that's where you create a new image. So the first thing to do is of course give it a name, put that at the top. And then the second thing I did was to upload my image. I thought that'd be a good place to start. And you do that down the bottom right hand corner. Across the top, there are some general settings where you can adjust colors of the background and all that kind of stuff. And you can also add a little bit more text. I'm not bothered with that because I'm gonna add some text around the image using Elementor. Uh, but it's a nice little feature if you wanna add kind of a little description next to your images. A little bit further down, we've got our options around the highlight styling. So they're the actual areas that you're gonna draw onto your image to make it interactive and you can adjust the colors and opacity and all that other stuff that you'd expect. Then at the bottom, you've got the fun bit, you've got the hotspot areas and it basically shows you your image and you just simply click around the bits that you want to highlight. So for example, on my image, I've got the barrow that I want to link off to on Amazon. So I, I drew round the barrow and you can be really precise with this and I've got a nice fit over the barrow bit. And then you've got your options where you can either add some text and maybe another image. So that'll pop up when someone clicks or what I wanted to do was add my Amazon affiliate link and you can just pop that in there and you can set it to open in a new window. And that's basically all there is to it. So I added a few different clickable areas. You can add as many as you want. I then saved the new interactive image and if you scroll down, you can see that there is a short code. 
You can use that short code to insert the image wherever you like on your WordPress website. So uh, I'm using Elementor, there is a short code widget. I just dropped that into the content, pasted the short code in and voila, there is my interactive image in all its glory with the image maps so that people can click on the barrow, they can see where that is on Amazon, they can click on the batteries and they can see where they are. So I think it's a really cool little plugin and I'm gonna be using it on all of my sites going forward. And I just know that there's people out there that have been waiting for something like this. Maybe they've got some map they wanna to add to their website. They've got maybe a technical diagram where they wanna highlight certain areas and make them clickable. Well, this plugin is gonna be perfect for you. So yeah, do go check out the plugin. There's a link below, remember, in the description. It's an affiliate link. Thank you very much. If you use it, I really appreciate it. If you've only got the one interactive image that you want to add to your site, then the free version will probably do what you need. Remember, you can install it via the plugin section of your website. Or if you just want to try it out before you buy it, again, the free version is probably a good place to start. So that brings us to the end of this video. I'd love to hear from you. Why not leave me a comment below? I do read all the comments that I get and I'll try to reply to as many as I possibly can. If you liked this video, please click the like button. That really does help me out. And to make sure you don't miss out on any future videos or any future live streams, be sure to click the subscribe button and make sure you click the bell. But anyway, until next time, good luck with your sites.